Hey, good morning, guys. Yeah, so, so many entries are here on the walls. You can come here to the Kentucky Derby Museum and check them out, or you can even visit their virtual tour online, which is a really great option. But we want to kind of feature some of the students' work. So, of course, we have, we're featuring great students' work over here, one from Barrett Traditional Middle School. We have um, Megan's teacher. Is it Megan, the student? Abigail. Hi. Megan Holes Connect, the visual arts teacher, is she going to talk about Abigail's uh, winning work. Yeah, this is Abby's beautiful painting that she created all at home. Um, we were able to meet through Google Meets, but she did this all on her own on top of assignments and everything that she was doing in school. And she really just worked hard on it and was inspired by her mother and grandmother's hats at the Derby and just wanted to celebrate the rich tradition of Derby and our awesome city, Louisville. So it was really cool to see this work um, in person once I got to pick it up at our school and turn it in. I know it was such a weird year. Like you said, she did it all on her own time in between all the school because you guys haven't been in school. Right. Um, and to see this come to life is really neat for you, I'm sure. What would you say is the most difficult part of this or was the most difficult part for her, the most impressive part to you? I think it was difficult just only being able to see her through the computer, mm -hmm. but I mean, she faced that challenge well, and if I was able to give her a revision, she went back and worked on it and changed some things, and just once I saw it, the day that she um, was finished with it, it was just amazing, just blew me away. So I was just so proud of her. Yeah. And she's such an amazing artist, so I was really proud. And she got the Millinery Fashion Award, which she got a really cool kind of prize. Can you tell us about that? Yes, she was able to attend a workshop and create her own fascinator and learn from a professional milliner. So that was just a really priceless um, opportunity for her, and I was just so excited that she got to do that and experience that. Yeah. It, and Miss Megan says that at Barrett Traditional Middle that she usually has to like cut off um, student art entries at five and this year she didn't even meet five. But if you look around, if, if you remember last year we were here, it was a lot more full. Um, the pandemic has also affected students um, submitting art because, you know, many are on their own this year. So come out and show them some support. There's some really cool stuff in here.